Hey, welcome back everybody. The Accidental Survivor here, and we are back with another tips, tricks, hints, and guide to survive the nights. And in this episode, we're going to talk about cooking and eating food. And the easiest way, we're, you know, I mean, obviously you can grab any kind of food in the game. You can grab canned food. You got to kind of heat it up, and that's a bit of a pain in the butt. I'm going to show you the easiest way to get and consume food in your game. Now, you preferably, you can do this with any weapon, but preferably you want to a uh, Clinchester or a hunting rifle. Unfortunately, the hunting rifle, the ghost hunter, are only located in either the police station, the airport armories, or if you're lucky, you can you can search farmhouses and there's a there's a chance that you may find one in there. But since that's not an option available to everybody, the next best thing you can use is a Clinchester. Now, so what you want to do is you want to go out here and try to find a deer. Here's one right here. I'm just going to take a nice close aim. One shot from the Clinchester will kill a deer. Let's try to get another one real quick. Oh, I missed him. Okay, well, we got one. There's some more over here. There's lots of deer. Once you kill on you, you want to make sure you also have in your possession, you know, you don't need it, but you want a um, combat knife. And you can find them just in various houses. Without a combat knife, you're not going to get as much resources. But with a combat knife... You want to hold a whole on E. I got five deer meat. So uh, now with the five deer meat, I want to kind of get a second deer. It is getting late in the game. Let's try to get this deer right here. Got him. Okay. And that's a Clinchester for you. You can you don't need the hunting rifle to go deer hunting, but the Clinchester is the next best thing. They, they take the same ammo. So let's go ahead and get some more deer. All right. got five more deer meat. That's ten. Um, I'm going to go for another deer. Just because I, I'm a big boy and my, my guy needs a lot of calories. So there we go. We got our third deer. And uh, once you get the deer, you want to either... Uh, you want to you try to find a cooking pot so you can put all this stuff in there. Okay, I got five more. So we got 15 deer meat. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump up here on a rock just because... Let's get some firewood too. Um... It's getting dark out, and I don't want the uh, horde coming at us. So uh, let's get my headlamp on, and we're gonna—I'm gonna show you here the easiest way. Like I said, I just killed three deer. I got 15 deer meat for you know a few shots, and uh, you can wherever you find deer in the in the uh, in the area. Now the best thing you can use uh, inside most houses are stoves that are full of wood, and you can you can do that no problem. You can put the pot on top of that, add your food. Uh, we're going to do it here in a campfire. So I already have a campfire and a campfire grill, but you may not have that yet. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to show you an easy way. We're going to craft a campfire. And you can craft a campfire. It only takes one piece of wood. So we already have that. We picked it up. We picked up some fi uh, some firewood or some wood. So now we're going to go ahead and place that. And we're going to place that right here. Oops. No, dude. I had two of them. Okay, so now I got the uh, campfire down, and you have to press E to add wood to it. So as you can see in my inventory, I've got, uh, hey, where the hell is my wood? I got four more pieces of wood. So I'm just going to add one, two, three, and four. Now, if you don't have a grill, you can craft one easily. You need a campfire grill in order to cook your food on the pot. So here we go, campfire grill. That takes three pieces of scrap metal, which is exactly what I have. And um, you can also, if you don't have a campfire grill, like I said, you can use the the uh, stoves that are inside the houses. Um, and also, you need to, if you can't find a cooking pot, you can craft one as well. And a large cooking pot, again, requires three scrap metal. I have both of those. I don't want to use up all my scrap metal because if I use up one, you know, so you'll want six scrap metal, one for the grill and one for the large cooking pot. But uh, once you get uh, your your uh, campfire down and you craft a campfire grill all you simply want to do is place that onto onto the uh, campfire and then get your uh, large cooking pot that you've crafted and again you want to place that on top of the grill and then you simply press E to open and then you go to your food menu which is up here where it says consumables and you can see I've got a uh, raw deer meat so I'm just going to stew all of that up you just keep doing that until you get all of them in there. And you can put any kind of food in here. It doesn't have to be deer meat. If you find food inside houses, canned food, 
cookies, crackers. You can throw all that in here. You see, I've got 8,400 calories. Yeah, of course, it's got to happen right now. So what you want to do then is you want to get your uh, fire started. <laughs> and I've got a freaking horde coming while doing my tutorial. Uh, so yeah, you want to wait. You want to wait for the. You want to wait for the food to boil. And once it boils. You can go ahead and eat it. So right now it's good to eat. I can go ahead and start eating. And you just eat as eat as much as you can until uh, you reach your max. Over here on my left column, you see it says 2,500, 5,500 calories. So there's 3,000, 3,500. Now 4,000, 4,500, 5,000. There we go. I got 5,500 calories. I've got all the calories I need for the night. I can pick the pot back up, pick up my uh, grill. You can you can turn this off. You can take the wood out of it, and you press Shift E to take wood. And you can pick up the campfire and take that away with you as well. But uh, since it's going to be too hard for me to talk with the, this freaking horde coming in, I'll go ahead and wrap it up here. I just want to show you an easy way that you can get your calories that you need for the day. By, instead of you know hunting through house after house trying to get your max calories go shoot a couple deer put them in a pot cook it up and you're good to go so again i thank you and i apologize for the freaking horde coming but i'll uh, see you guys next time